parents died when he was young. His father dies when he's three. His mother dies when he's four. He's an orphan by the time he's five. And he grows up in abusive places and everybody thinks he's weird and everybody thinks he's unusual and everyone is jealous of him, talks about him, thinks that he's a threat and all he's trying to do is help people. All he's trying to do is to shine the light of Hashem in the world, to show that Hashem loves you. And even though the whole Jewish world had been going a certain way for almost 2,000 years, comes Yisrael, Baal Shem Tov, and says Hashem wants something different. He wants love. He wants peace. He wants unity. Yes, it's good to learn Torah. You know what he likes more? That you're simple. That you care for others. That you care for orphans, that you care for widows, that you care for others more than yourself. And he was vehemently attacked for this in his lifetime. Vehemently attacked. And on paper he has every reason to quit. But he didn't. And he gave birth to the most beautiful, beautiful tzaddikim that ever lived. The Magad of Mezrich, the Noam Elimelech, Rav Zusha of Napoli, Rav Nachman of Horodenka, Rav Nachman of Breslov, of the Balatanya. All of these beautiful tzaddikim were shining the light of Hashem in the world. <laughs> Show!